Over the past few years, we've seen incredible breakthroughs in machine learning. From models that can explain jokes or answer visual questions in different languages. To those that can generate images based on textual descriptions. These advancements have been made possible by the availability of large-scale datasets and the development of new technologies to train models on this data. However, traditional robotics models have faced challenges due to a lack of comparable datasets, which has led to slower progress compared to other fields. But Google has just released Palm E, a new generalist robotics model that's set to change the world of robotics. By transferring knowledge from diverse visual and language domains to a robotics system, Palm E overcomes the challenges faced by traditional robotics models. In this video, we'll discuss the challenges faced by traditional robotics models and how Palm E, a new generalist robotics model, is pushing the boundaries of what's possible in the field of robotics. So, buckle up and join us on this thrilling journey into the future of robotics. But before we continue, hit that subscribe button if you want to stay up to date for more scary AI topics. Robotics is a rapidly growing field within technology and is increasingly being used in our daily lives. From drones delivering packages to robots working in factories, the possibilities seem endless. However, training robots is still one of the biggest challenges in the machine learning world. Training robots using sensor data is an important development because it allows robots to learn more about their environment. This can be of great value in applications such as industrial automation, autonomous vehicles, and healthcare. Palm E is an advanced language model that uses sensor data from robots to perform tasks. This is an important difference compared to previous attempts to bring large language models to robots, which only used textual input. Palm E uses multimodal sentences, where text and other modalities such as images, robot states, and scene embeddings can be inputted in any order. This allows the model to perform tasks on multiple robots and for multiple modalities. But how does Palm E work? Palm E works by injecting observations into a pre-trained language model. This is achieved by converting sensor data, such as images, into a representation that is comparable to how words of natural language are processed by a language model. The model uses encoders that convert different types of input into the same space as the natural word token embeddings. By giving the text and images the same dimensionality, they can be processed together in the language model. An example of how Palm E works is a robot that needs to learn to recognize objects and then sort them. The robot can do this using images and sensor data. By inputting this information into Palm E, the model can take the appropriate actions based on the input. This could be, for example, picking up and moving an object to the correct location. Benefits Palm E offers a new paradigm for training a generalist model that combines robot tasks and visual language tasks in a common representation. Palm E can effectively learn multiple tasks without a drop in performance compared to training individual models on individual tasks. Furthermore, the visual linguistic data improves the performance of robot tasks, making Palm E more efficient at learning tasks. Another benefit of Palm E is that it provides the ability to train robots for different tasks. In the past, researchers had to train individual models for specific tasks such as object sorting or navigating through a space. With Palm E, one model can be used for multiple tasks, making it more efficient and cost-effective to train robots. Another benefit of Palm E is that it uses multimodal input, making the model more robust and better able to handle unpredictable situations. For example, if a robot is in an unfamiliar environment and is unsure of how to perform tasks, Using multiple modalities such as text, images, and robot states can help provide the robot with the necessary information to successfully complete the task. There are also applications outside of robotics for Palm E. The model can be used for natural language processing and text comprehension, which can be useful for chatbots and other AI applications. 
Palm E offers a lot of potential for the future of robotics and machine learning. By training robots using sensor data and multimodal input, Palm E can help develop more efficient and robust robots capable of performing complex tasks in real-world situations. On the other hand, there are also potential scary consequences of Palm E. One of the biggest concerns is that the technology could be used to develop advanced autonomous weapons. For example, Palm E could be used to train drones or other machines to autonomously find and destroy targets without human intervention. Another potential problem is that Palm E could threaten employment. With the ability to train robots for various tasks, Palm E in some cases could lead to the replacement of human labor by robots. Therefore, it is important to regulate and monitor the development of Palm E and other advanced technologies to ensure that they are used in a responsible and ethical manner. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and let us know in the comments below what you thought of it. Also don't forget to click the video on screen. Because in it I am going to tell you more about the fascinating scary world of AI.